morning, Washington Elementary Patriots, and welcome to WSIC, Washington School is Cool News Program. I'm Jackson Bergen, your news anchor for today. Today is Wednesday, March 22, 2017. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for a moment of silence. Congratulations to Mr. Dale for showcasing our artwork during the art show last night. Way to go Learning Center A for sharing your singing and acting talents during the Let Your Garden Grow performance. Remember, today is birthday with the principal. On the menu for lunch today, you will have a choice between hamburger or cheeseburger, fruit and yogurt parfait, potato wedges, home style baked beans, beans, Crane and coleslaw and fresh orange wedges slash bananas will also be served. Let's now check in with our other WSIC reporters and see what they have to share with us today. Good morning. I'm Jacob Johnson, your WSIC meteorologist for the week. Today will be 61 degrees. It will be cloudy this morning, but some sunshine tomorrow, this afternoon. Tomorrow will be 63 degrees. It will be rain showers. Our proud patriot for the day is Aslan from Learning Center A. Looking great, Aslan. Thanks for your help. Reporting for WSIC, I'm Jacob Johnson. Tune in tomorrow for the day's forecast. Now back to the studio. Do all plants have roots? Have you ever stopped to take a look at the world around you and think about how many different types of plants you see? A simple walk through your backyard or a local park will reve reveal hundreds of different types of plants. Plants take on many shapes, sizes, and colors, yet they are quite similar in how they put, are put together for the most part. Whether you're looking at a tree, a flower, or a blade of grass, all plants have certain things in common. Plants conduct photosynthesis, a process through which they convert the sun's energy into food they need to grow and survive. Photosynthesis occurs in chloroplasts, which are tiny organelles located within plant cells. Chloroplasts collect light and convert that light to energy with the help of chlorophyll, moleculars, and special enzymes. Many p plants, such as trees and flowers, have vascular systems. These vascular plants have a system of tubes they use to transport nutrients and water to different parts of the plants. Vascular plants all have similar parts such as stems, leaves, and roots. The roots, for example, have several important functions. They pull water and minerals from the environment to nourish the plant. This is why they grow down, because the water and minerals needed for growth are below the ground in the soil. soil. I'm Elisa Cologne. Now back to the studio. Today on Get to Know, we will learn more about Mrs. Waking, who is the teacher at our school. Thank you, Mrs. Waking, for joining us on Get to Know. I have a few questions to help everyone get to know you a little better. Who was your very first teacher as a kid? My very first teacher was my ballet teacher, and I was three years old. So my first teacher taught me ballet. 
Our second question is, what is your favorite book and who's your favorite character? My favorite book is by Robert Munch called The Paper Bag Princess. And in that book, there's a character named Elizabeth, and she's the princess, and Ronald is the prince. Third question, where is your favorite place to go in your spare time? I love to go to the Greenway in Kingsport and run, and I like to take my new baby with me. When you were little, what did you love to do? I loved to build with blocks. I loved the large wooden blocks that we have in our classrooms, and I loved to make tall buildings with them. Why do you like teaching, and what is your favorite about it? I like teaching children because I like to see how much they can learn across the whole year, from August to May. How is it like being a teacher? It is tough that I have a lot to remember, but my favorite part is also getting hugs from kiddos. Thank you, Mrs. Waking. It was great getting to know you. I'm Marcy for Get to Know. Now back to the studio. Thanks, team. Remember, if you have anything exciting happening in your learning center, please let WSIC know. Send an email to our crew at WSIC at K12K.com. Who are the best flyers in the ocean? The pilot fish! Signing off for the WSIC crew, I'm Jackson Bergen. Tune in next time for your WSIC news. Have a great day! Yeah.